I've used different machines over time and some of them will have nice features, others will have different features that I like and I think the NGC actually puts everything together. So I liken it to using an Apple product compared to a PC product, for example. So we've got two main themes of our research at, at, at present. One is to understand how cellular messenger RNAs are translated into protein, and another is to understand how viruses actually um, hijack the cellular machinery um, to make its own protein. The cellular messages um, are interesting because some of them will be very efficiently translated into protein and others will not be efficiently translated into protein. And so we're trying to understand how the code of the messenger RNA works. Viruses actually need to get into the cell in order to make their own proteins. And so they often do this by using a subset of the machinery that's needed for the cellular translation. And in return, they actually um, inactivate some of the machinery so that then they can make their own proteins. So it's quite a devious way to do it. Protein synthesis must be tightly regulated in all cells, um, and that's partly due to if you overexpress some proteins, um, they can result in diseases like cancer. Um, whereas if you don't make enough of other proteins, you can result in diseases like diabetes. Um, so a lot of the pieces of the puzzle are already in place. But now it's really putting them together to understand how they fit together and how they function as um, a, a machine. So my lab takes a biochemistry approach to many of the problems we're trying to answer. And so we often will reconstitute a system using purified components so that we can study individual components and how they function in the pathway. So one of the biggest challenges we face is and those components um, are very large and complicated components. Some of them we're able to make recombinantly from either bacteria or insect cell um, infections with baclaviruses, or we make them or purify them from endogenous sources from cell lines. And then we'll go through a series of chromatography steps. So the NGC system is really good for our research um, for a number of reasons. One is the Modules allow you to customize the system um, over time, which is a good feature. The front-facing system actually is very good because it allows you easy access to all of the different valves and connecting columns to the system. The software is very easy to use and intuitive, and that easily allows you to follow how well you're doing with your purification scheme at any point in time how clean is my protein and how much of it is there. One of the things that we typically will do um, pretty often is actually make truncations or mutations of the components that we work with. And those will normally pose a different purification scheme for us. Um, and so we have to evolve our purification schemes depending on the truncation or mutation that we're trying to make. And the NGC, I think, really allows us to switch between users and purification schemes very quickly and easily. That's actually a good thing for us because we have a lot of students that work in the lab and um, I found it was very quick for them to understand and learn how to use the system compared with our previous system. Creating methods is really easy actually. Um, you just drag and drop features into the method uh, profile and then um, you can follow through everything graphically. When you use the point to plumb feature, uh, we particularly like the little LED lights that light up, allowing you to connect different pipes and tubing to each part of the valves, for example. And it just follows that through one step at a time, and it was very, very easy to do. Obtaining highly pure components so that we can fundamentally understand the mechanism is allowing us to make models and predictions about things that we can test in cells. And the NGC really allows us to obtain these components very rapidly and very well. Now we have a product that 
we really, really like at the end that, that is doing exactly what we want and how we want it to happen. Mm -hmm.